The question is that Amendment 7735.1, in the name of Stephen Kerr, which seeks to amend Business Motion 7735, in the name of George Adam, on behalf of the Parliamentary Bureau, setting out a business programme, be agreed, and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. Point of order, Ruth McGuire. My app failed. I would have voted no. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded. Point of order, Kenneth Gibson. Next to digital platform, I would have voted no. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded. Mr Gibson, I can confirm that your vote was in fact recorded. The result of the vote on amendment number 7735.1 in the name of Stephen Kerr is yes 54, no 66. There were no abstentions. The amendment is therefore not agreed. The next question is that motion 7735 in the name of George Adam on behalf of the Parliamentary Bureau setting out a business programme be agreed. Are we all agreed? Yes. The motion is therefore agreed. The next item of business is consideration of Parliamentary Bureau Motion 7736 on a committee substitute. And I ask George Adam, on behalf of the Parliamentary Bureau, to move the motion. Thank you, President Officer. I moved. Thank you. The question on this motion will be put at decision time. And there are four questions to be put as a result of today's business. And can I remind members that if the amendment in the name of Alexander Stewart is agreed to, the amendment in the name of Sarah Boyack will fall. And the first question is that amendment 7710.1 in the name of Alexander Stewart, which seeks to amend motion 7710 in the name of Richard Lockhead on three years on Brexit and workers' rights be agreed. Are we all agreed? No. The Parliament is not agreed. Therefore, we will move to a vote and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. Point of order, Ruth Maguire. Having connectivity issues, I would have voted no. Thank you, Ms Maguire. I'm sure that's recorded. Point of order, Kenneth Gibson. Connect. I would have voted no. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded. Just, if you, just bear, bear with, with us one, one moment. Thank you.
Point of order, Carol Mockin. Uh, thank you. I would have voted no. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded. I can confirm that your vote was recorded, Ms Mockin. Point of order, Katie Clark. I would have voted no. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded. The result of the vote on amendment number 7710.1 in the name of Alexander Stewart is yes 30, no 89. There were no abstentions. The amendment is therefore not agreed. The next question is that amendment 7710.2 in the name of Sarah Boyack, which seeks to amend motion 7710 in the name of Richard Lockhead on three years on, Brexit and workers' rights be agreed. Are we all agreed? No. The Parliament is not agreed, therefore we'll move to a vote and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. The result of the vote on amendment number 7710.2 in the name of Sarah Boyack is yes 24, no 96. There were no abstentions. The amendment is therefore not agreed. The third question is that motion 7710 in the name of Richard Lockhead on three years on Brexit and workers' rights be agreed. Are we all agreed? Yes. Can I just check again? No. We are not agreed. Thank you. The Parliament is not agreed, therefore we will move to a vote and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. Point of order, Marie Goujon. Thank you. We'll ensure that's recorded.
The result of the vote on motion 7710 in the name of Richard Lockhead is yes 90, no 30. There were no abstentions. The motion is therefore agreed. The final question is that motion 7736 in the name of George Adam on a committee substitute be agreed. Are we all agreed? Yes. The motion is therefore agreed. That concludes decision time. We'll move on to members' business. And I ask members who are leaving the chamber to please do so quietly.